let's be honest, you and I both want to talk about Ghostface. It appears that the rumors are true, as we have gotten confirmation and a trailer to more DLC for Mortal Kombat 1. On top of the story DLC that we're getting, we are getting more guest characters, like the T-1000 from Terminator 2, Arnold Schwarzenegger's Conan the Barbarian, and Ghostface. I have a bunch of theories as to who Ghostface might be in Mortal Kombat 1. Because <laughs> you know they're going to play with it in his own character ending. My first theory is he's probably going to be a new character set in the Mortal Kombat 1 universe. Or multiverse, whichever comes first. But a possibility, but still the most least likely, is that it, it could be Stu. It could be Stu. Hear me out. It could be Stu. Because one of the most popular fan theories is that Stu is alive. Not just from our fan desire, but originally in Scream 3, he was actually supposed to be the killer, but was opted out because of real life events with the Columbine Massacre that had happened around the same time as the movie was being developed. So to be more respectful, they had to change the identity of the villain. But the theory of Stu being alive was actually referenced in Scream 6. TV that killed Stumacher. If you believe he's dead. I could totally see Netherum having fun with this, being that they're going for a multiverse angle, so anything's possible. But one theory that I love to death, and hear me out, this is my own theory that I just came up with. What if, because we're dealing with the multiverse, what if the killer is actually Johnny Cage? In an alternate universe, instead of being an action star, He's a horror star, a Scream King for instance. Wanting to make the perfect horror movie, he adopts the persona of Ghostface. Another dumb idea is that he could use the multiverse as a means to record for his own movies to show real kills and real gore because Johnny Cage never pulls any punches. You know, Johnny Cage the action star, whenever he does action scenes, it's for real, He, because he's the real deal. So a serial killer ghost face Johnny Cage would probably do something similar, but with horror. But since it's the multiverse, he could basically make a real life snuff film, and nobody would know because the people he kills in another universe they would still be alive in his universe. I <laughs> I mean, he could totally get away with it. By the way, I just want to make a disclaimer. This is just for fun. This is me speculating. This is me having fun with this idea of Ghostface being in Mortal Kombat 1. This is not for real. It's not serious. But hey, if you like it, if you like my stupid ideas, please subscribe and keep on the lookout for more videos.